I'm going to make a sink for my little bathroom and for that I take my toilet and this is a piece of scrap clay. I like to make molds of my creations. So I'm starting with cutting a bottom edge for my sink and my sink is the same height as the bathroom uh, as the toilet. I like it to be around the same white as the toilet. And then I'm just going to uh, start molding it because there's no need for the bottom part of the uh, the sink to be that big. It's depending on how you like your uh, sink to be. When you're happy with your shape, you bake it and make a mold. I made my mold of my little sink here, so I'm going to put that aside. And using my mold, I am going to take some clay in the color I like. And for this, I am using opaque white. You can use whatever color you like. And I am taking a dotting tool, making sure that all my clay is in the bottom of my mold. Like this. And I'm going to bake this in the mold. I baked my small sink uh, and now I'm going to take a piece of sandpaper and I'm going to sand the bottom of it because it ha have a edgy bottom this one. I'm happy with my sink now and I'm going to take some bacon bond. Just a tiny bit here, I don't need that much. And I rolled out some golden clay in a very thin snake. Have that here. And just with the like with the bathtub, I am going to make uh, two small handles and the water thing. I don't know what you call that. Um, and I'm going to take this piece and I'm bending it. into like an, a U, taking some of my pick and bond, putting right there where I want the piece, taking the tiny piece and placing it on my sink and these two small pieces I am rolling into balls, two small balls here and again I am using my bacon bond to make them stick where I need them to go on each side here by laying this tiny sink on the back like this I'm sure this way I'm sure it can stand up uh, by the wall in my room so I'm going to bake it like this and then I'm going to glaze it and that's actually it. So happy crafting! <laughs>